Night Times is made possible in part by a grant from the Northwest Area Foundation. Twin Cities. This is Nighttime's Variety with Michelle Barber. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Nighttime's Variety. Tonight, we're going to be bringing you some very powerful scenes from the Mixed Blood Company's production of For Color Girls Who Have Considered Suicide When the Rainbow Is Enough. It's a powerful production that is right now playing to rave reviews, standing room only crowds. It's a good production. We'll be seeing that a little bit later on this evening. Also, we're going to be bringing you the very unique music of a quartet called the Consort. The Consort plays a great variety of instruments, and their musical styles range from European music to jazz to folk. And first of all this evening, I'm very happy to present to you a good friend of mine who is currently working on a new album. His hit single, Bluer Than Blue, was number one on the charts for eight weeks. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very proud to present to you Michael Johnson. Thank you, Michael. Michael Johnson will be performing in concert December 27th at the O'Shaughnessy Auditorium in St. Paul. He's a very fine performer and a very, very nice man, and I thank him for being here tonight. Right now, I'd like to introduce you to a very unique group of performers. They play a very unique style of music, and they use a lot of different types of instruments than you would normally see. Instruments such as the hammer dulcimer, 
and also a beautiful Greek stringed instrument called the bazooki. The first tune that they're going to be doing for us this evening is a Greek song. It's entitled Oniro, ladies and gentlemen, the consort. Once in a great while does something come along to show the raw and visceral power of the theater. The current production at the Mixed Blood Theater is one such example. It's called For Color Girls Who Have Considered Suicide When the Rainbow is Enough. It's not billed as a play, but rather a choreo poem, which is poetry with dance. Tonight we are privileged enough to have two fine actresses from that production at Mixed Blood, Denise Ellis and Margaret McGrady, to do some selected scenes from this production. It's a very powerful piece of theater. dark phrases of womanhood, of never having been a girl, half notes scattered, without rhythm, no tune, distraught laughter falling over a black girl's shoulder. It's funny. It's hysterical. The melody-lessness of her dance. Don't tell nobody. Don't tell a soul. She's dancing on beer cans and shingles. This must be the spook house. Are we animals? Have we gone crazy? I can't hear anything but maddening screams and the soft strains of death. And you promised me. You promised me. You promised me. Somebody. Anybody, sing a black girl's song. Bring her out to know herself, to know you, 
but sing her rhythms. Karen, struggle, hard times. Sing her song of life. She's been dead so long, closed in silence so long, she doesn't know the sound of her own voice, her infinite beauty. She's half notes, scattered without rhythm, no tune. Sing her sighs, sing a song of her possibilities, sing a righteous gospel, the making of a melody. And let her be born, let her be born and handled warmly. Without any assistance or guidance from you, I have loved you assiduously for eight months, three weeks, and a day. I have been stood up four times. I've left seven packages on your doorstep, 40 poems, two plants, and three handmade note cards. I left town so I could send them to you. You have been no help to me on my job. You call me up at three o'clock in the morning so I can drive 27 and a half miles across the bay before I go to work. <laughs> charmin, <laughs> charmin. But I want you to know you have been of no assistance. This was an experiment to see how selfish I could be if I would really carry on to snare a possible lover, if I was capable of debasing myself for the love of another, if I could stand not being wanted when I wanted to be wanted and I cannot. So, with no further assistance and no guidance from you, I am ending this affair. This note is attached to a plant I have been watering since the day I met you. You may water it your damn self. Oh, Denise, that man will be back tomorrow talking about, I'm sorry. I know that, Margaret. Get this. Mm -hmm. My old man came in talking about, now I do you like I do you because I thought you could take it. Ooh. Now, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, Margaret, this is him right here. I'm only human. And it is an adequacy that make us human. Now, if we was perfect, we wouldn't have nothing to strive for. So you might as well go on and forgive me, pretty baby, because uh, I'm sorry. No, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> You got him. <laughs> now, I know that you know mm -hmm. that I love you. Ooh. But listen, Mama see. Hey, what's your name? <sighs> I ain't never gonna love you the way you want me to now. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Catch you later. <sighs> One thing I don't need is any more apologies. I got sorries greeting me at my front door. You can keep yours. I don't know what to do with them. I'm gonna tack a sign on my door. Leave a message right by my phone. If you call to say you're sorry, call someone else. Cause I don't use them anymore. You were always inconsistent. Always doing something and then being sorry. Beating my poor heart to death talking about you sorry. Well, I will not call. I will not be nice. I will raise my voice and scream and holler and break things and race the engine and act a raven fool. I will tell all your secrets about yourself to your face. I will list in detail every one of my wonderful lovers and their ways. And I won't be sorry for none of it. I loved you on purpose. I was open on purpose. And I still crave vulnerability and close talk, and I ain't even sorry about you being sorry. Now, you can carry all the guilt and grime you wanna. Just don't give it to me, because I can't use another sorry. Next time, you should admit you're mean. Low down, trifling, no account, straight out. Instead of being sorry all of the time, just enjoy being yourself.
ever since I realized there was someone called a colored girl, an evil woman, or a nag, I've been trying not to be that. And leave bitterness in somebody else's cup. Come to somebody to love me without deep and nasty smelling scald from lie or being left screaming in a street full of lunatics. I brought you what joy I found. And I found joy, honest fingers round my face, with dead musicians on 78s from Cuba or live musicians on $5 LPs from Chicago, where I have never been. And I love Willie Colon and Arsenio Rodriguez, especially because I can make the music loud enough so there is no me but dance. And when I can dance like that, there ain't nothing that can hurt me. But I get tired, and I have to come off of the floor. And then there's that woman who hurt you, who you left three or four times and just went back. After you put my heart in the bottom of your shoe, you just walked back to where you hurt. And I didn't have nothing. So I went to where somebody had something for me. But he wasn't you. And I was on my way back from in the bottom of her shoe. So this is not a love poem. Because there are only memorial albums available. This is a requiem for myself. Because I have died in a real way. And I don't know anymore how to avoid my own face wet with my tears. Because I had convinced myself colored girls have no right to sorrow. And I lived and I loved that way and kept sorrow on the curb, allegedly for you. But I know. I did it for myself. I couldn't stand it. I couldn't stand being sorry and colored at the same time. So redundant in the modern world. I sat up one night, walking a boarding house, crying, Screaming the ghost of another woman who was missing what I was missing. I wanted to jump up out of my bones and be done with myself. Leave me alone. Go on in the wind. Because it was too much. I fell into a numbness. Till the only tree I could see just lifted me up in her branches and held me in the breeze, made me dawn do that silence, that chill at daybreak. Oh, the sun wrapped me up swinging rose light everywhere. And the sky laid over me like a million men. I was cold. I was hot. I was a child again. And endless. Weaving garments for the moon with my tears. I found God in myself, and I loved her. I loved her fiercely. You can still see the Mixed Blood production of Four Color Girls. It will be running now through January 4th. Catch it if you can, it's an excellent production. Right now, I would like to bring back once again the consort with a beautiful tune from Ireland. This is a ballad, and it's entitled, As I Roved Out. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, the consort.
as I roved out on a bright May morning to view the meadows and flowers gay. Whom should I spy but my own true lover? As he Thank you very much. I would like to thank my guests this evening, the consort. Thank you so much. You just sound wonderful. I would also like to thank my friend Michael Johnson for being with us, and of course, Denise Ellis and Margaret McGrady from the Mixed Blood Theater. Next Monday night on Nighttime's Variety, my guests are going to be the legendary jazz drummer Max Roach. Max Roach has performed with such great musicians as Dizzy Gillespie, Charlie Parker, and many more. He's a fabulous musician, and it's going to be a great honor to have him with us. The guys from Earl's TV Tap will also be with us back once again, yes, sir. And also the very inventive sounds of the group Rio Nido. So please join us next Monday night. Also, tomorrow night on Night Times Magazine, they will be having an interview with Governor Alqui. So stay tuned tomorrow night at 7 o'clock for that. I'm Michelle Barber. I will see you again Monday night at 7 o'clock for Night Times Variety. Good night.
Night Times is made possible in part by a grant from the Northwest Area Foundation. Night Times is a production of Twin Cities Public Television, which is solely responsible for its content. If you would like to be part of the studio audience, please write Night Times Variety, 1640 Como Avenue, St. Paul, Minnesota, 55108 for information.